This Valentine's Day, I'm dishing out a classic dessert from the 70s, Crepe Suzette, and I'm turning them pink with the help of Beats as part of Tastemade's Valentine's Day series, 50 Shades of Red, where you can watch other tastemakers use Beats' color of love. But first, let's get to our Beats. First, roast your beets until fork tender, peel and puree in a processor or a blender. Then add it to a mixing bowl along with two whole eggs, some milk, sifted flour, sugar and salt, and we can't forget the melted butter. Now mix it all up until you have a smooth, gorgeous batter. Now butter a nonstick pan on medium-high heat. Pour a ladle of batter while rotating the pan to distribute it equally. And once the edges are dry, flip it over and continue cooking for just a minute. And keep on making crepes. Don't worry if you screw up the first one, you'll get a hang of it, I promise. Now melt some butter in a saucepan. Add sugar and let it slightly bubble away until the sugar has dissolved. Then add the zest of some oranges and their juice as well. Get it all in there. Now fold the crepes into quarters and into a pan by slightly overlapping them. You could do all of this ahead of time. Just heat up the sauce when it's time for dessert and trust me, your Valentine's gonna be so impressed by this part. Pour over the orange butter, heat some orange liqueur and pour it on the top. And now set those crepes on fire. Make this for your lover, you'll definitely knock off more than their socks. Subscribe to Just Eat Life TV and enjoy some more Valentine's Day videos, including these from our fellow tastemakers.